Hey, Money Guy family, it's your host, Brian Preston, with Mr. Bo Hansen. We had an absolute blast making our Tesla videos, and you guys obviously had a lot of fun in the comments section letting us know what you think <laughs> about us. Uh, if you haven't had a chance to go check out the videos, there's a link below. Make sure you go check out all of our Tesla series. You can look at all of the other videos on our channel, check out our personal finance stuff. Make sure that you subscribe so you can stay dialed in with everything that we have going on. So as our friend Taylor Swift would say, a hater is going to hate. And so we wanted to compile the top 10 comments that people that trolled us, told us things we ought to reconsider for our own safety, <laughs> and just revamp how we even look or think about ourselves with our self-esteem. So this is going to be a fun, strap yourself in, put the seatbelt on, let's get into this. It's Brian Preston, the money guy. Top 10. Number 10 from Hughes reviews quote this video should be titled i nitpicked the crap out of the amazing new car that i love oh you you're kind of right <laughs> uh comment number nine you guys were so kind as to let us know who we reminded you of and uh dj ice bling which is awesome uh, I think this was in reference to me, said, this guy looks like PC Principal from <laughs> South Park. Thank while, you. While we're talking about how we look, this one's from Limp Wibbler. <laughs> sorry hey, about that, Wibbler. Yeah, Limp, we're, we're so sorry for that. The quote, you look like the guy in Silicon Valley who invests in Pod Piper. Peter Gregory, right? <laughs> well, I went and looked it up. Here's the thing. He does have great hair. I've had this same great hair since the third grade, but you have to give me credit. I at least look like his younger, better looking brother. <laughs> That's the way I look at it. I love it, I love it. Uh, and then I did have one other celebrity look-alike. Uh, this is from F. Chidez. Uh, passenger looks like Daniel Tosh. I, I think that's a compliment. If so, thank you. If it's an insult, you know, well, bless your heart. Thanks. Halfway through this thing, and here we are with UFO trailers, you both so uncool and greasy. I do have naturally greasy hair, so I shower a lot UFO. So maybe you saw through that, because I definitely showered that morning. But, you know, I, I'll give it the run cool. How about, again, then Dom, Dominique uh, Sa Sabo, Sabo wanted to add to this. Uh, it said, he said, uh, these peoles are stupid and they are even advertising. <laughs> Way to sell it, Dominique. Thank you, Dominique. <laughs> <laughs> this is from Rosty. Quote, Teslas aren't for everyone, especially for old timers like you. Millennials appreciate them more. Yeah, so I appreciate it more. Yeah, that's fine. All right, uh, the, the next one. Oh, Brian, you got, there, I thought this was awesome, that there are some folks that are very concerned about your safety. Oh, gosh. This is, what they don't, I'm going to go ahead and set this up. This is Ramon. Ramon doesn't realize I'm a highly skilled and highly trained professional that in a past life, all through college, I drove a big school bus with a commercial driver's license. So you're a professional driver. I got, I was an award-winning trainer and driver, but here's his quote from Ramon. Quote, Brian, if that is the way you normally hold the steering wheel during a turn, dude, you need to attend an advanced driving course ASAP. The potential for disaster as the, lo the loss of control is very high. Ramon. I'm recalibrating the way I'm, I mean, the, the three and nine is obviously not happening anymore in the Preston household. So thank you for that. Uh, and then, you know, uh, we had another, another one, Brian, and I think this again, uh, I'm going to let you read this, this one. This is the top two. So we're down to number two. Here it goes. And this is from Double Clutch o -line, uh, Online, Double Clutch Online, quote, oh, the agony of having to lift your arm like a common poor and close the trunk manually. What are we, cavemen? Put the all caps there. This guy is a little too precious for my taste. I've never been called precious, so that was kind of... <laughs> thank I mean, you, Double Clutch. Yeah, thank you. Sweet. Uh, and then our number one uh, favorite comment, and I, I think this, this is actually, this is Elon's brother, isn't it? I think cousin. I think probably cousin. Probably, probably All right. cousin. All right, so this is his cousin. This is from Scott Musk. Uh, our number one favorite comment is, 
A Tesla is like a high-grade woman with all her complexities. You two clearly don't know or see overall beauty, and you never will. Yeah, I love that Bo gave us his bedroom voice for that. <laughs> Did y'all notice that? So he wanted to make sure we knew he knew the complexities of a high-grade woman with that bedroom voice. But we couldn't close it out with a top 10. There were some honorable mentions because we're always looking for ways on the Money Guy Show to give you bonus content. Right. Yep. So I want to give Bo a chance to, to kind of give two more honorable mentions that we thought Hey, they'd be worth sharing. Yeah, this, th these hit pretty close to home. The first is from, uh, from Mike Atkins, and he said, Guy with the sunglasses was crucial to this car review. LOL. Uh, Mike, we heard you loud and clear. There was no guy with sunglasses in this review. So thank you for that recommendation. Uh, and then the last one uh, is from Michael. How would you say Michael's name? Is that Amador? Amador? Just act like you own it. Like, Amador. Yeah, we'll go with that one. Uh, and he said, uh, your sidekick needs to take off his sunglasses and stop acting like a Johnny Cab from Total Recall. The cheesiness is very high. What do you think about that one? <laughs> I think, I know where you're going to go. You're going to say, Who's the Johnny Cab and who's Arnold Schwarzenegger? So who's, who are you saying is who? Uh, it sounds to me like with sunglasses, I was Johnny Cab. So I guess I guess we have the Arnold in the driver's seat. If y'all could see, obviously we didn't measure biceps before we did this. Bo would definitely be Arnie in, in that video. But guys, and truthfully, to kind of close this thing, we really enjoy your comments. I know you guys, you probably, I don't know if you're trying to hurt us or if you're just trying to be a public service announcement. And if, and if you haven't had a chance to subscribe, make sure you click below, subscribe to the channel, go check out all of our other Tesla videos, go check out all the other content we have out there. We love you being part of the family, being part of the community. And good news. We're doing this all over again. This went so well. You guys gave us so much great feedback, including the trolls and the clown comments, that we wanted to do it all over again. So we have a whole new series on Tesla and the Model 3 coming out. Please join us. As Bo said, subscribe, follow, and without a doubt, you got to leave just as good of comments as you did on the previous series. Thanks so much. I'm your host, Brian Preston, Mr. Bo Hansen. We'll see you soon.